and welcome back. This is Beller Scuba with another StarCraft 2 commentary. I am the Red Terran in the Northeast up against a Knicks fan. Hey, a New Yorker, I guess, from, uh, well, the blue Protoss in the Southwest. Uh, Knicks, of course, play basketball. Yay, I do know sports, even though I play video games. Uh, yeah, I feel sorry for him, actually. The Knicks are actually a really bad team right now. Uh, but I know what that's like. I'm actually a Broncos fan. Ouch. So, uh, the map, once again, is Steps of War. I always seem to play these in pairs. It's not like I uh, script it this way. It just so happens to work out that way. Uh, but last time, of course, it was against a Zerg player, so we should be seeing a little different strategy from the Protoss player. Hopefully he does not send Zerglings and Roaches my way. Pylon going out for him, Supply Depot going up for me, nothing out of the usual there, and once again, nothing out of the unusual, I have about a 16 APM in the early game, and here I do go for a scout, uh, because this is a map that does lend well to that. Uh, 16 APM, you know, pretty much until um, my uh, army is ready to go. I, if you guys have higher APM, more power to you. I just uh, don't know if how much more effective it is to have anything higher than that. It seems to be working well for me. Uh, I'm on a bit of a winning streak myself. Uh, I Last I checked, I was uh, ranked 11th. So I am moving up the ladder. I don't know what it's going to take for me to move up uh, to silver. I'm still stuck in bronze. Uh, but I'm looking forward to the day when I can say, hey, you know what, I'm not in bronze anymore, I'm not a complete noob at the game. Because it always feels like I am, because I'm on the lowest ladder. And his probe is going to follow me almost all the way into my base, and he's going to hang out in the bushes, because he's creepy like that. And, oh my gosh, you should be in orbital command by now, but I don't have any money. Um, there we go, I was actually waiting for money, uh, second, because I got the second barracks first, as well as a supply depot. And now that probe finally decides, hey, you know what, I should probably check out what he's got in there. Um, you could say that he sees something with that second barracks, he did select it, so he does know what that is, but it, he doesn't see much, I'll give him that. Um, Nexus on the way, so even if he did think that I was going for a push, or at least, actually now I think about it, he, he can't possibly think that I'm going for the push because he's getting that second Nexus. Why waste, what is, I don't even know, For it, it's 400 for a Terran, so I'm going to assume it's 400 for a Protoss as well to get that second Nexus up and running. He is researching warp gate. Just got the one gateway, or yeah, just the one gateway. It looks like now just the second one coming in. Probe chilling out. This is his builder probe, which is very similar to what I used to do in StarCraft One uh, when I played as Protoss. You just had the one uh, builder probe that was hanging out all the time. He did get his first zealot out. Second one on the way. I am getting uh, Marines and Marauders. Surprise, surprise. Uh, Stimpak uh, going down, continually pumping out the SCVs. I should be getting another SCV and a mule, it looks like. Uh, looks like I was doing something else. But look, I, I am working, but uh, not nearly as fast as I should, apparently. But my APM is up to over 20. Awesome. And concussive shells being researched for me. Pretty standard still. Nothing out of the ordinary from me. And you probably will never see it out of me. I'm uh, pretty much a vanilla guy. Four gateways coming up, as usual. Warp gate is done researching, but he did not warp these yet. Um, not There we go. Two of them being changed as... The other one is queuing up zealots. Um, 
that's kind of strange. Not sure what's going on there. This one's morphing as well. Here we go. Using the warp gates. Does he cancel these? Yes, he cancels those zealots so he can start using his warp gates instead. Um, once again, three barracks into an engineering bay. I do love this build. I don't know if it's exactly... Um, how do I put it? If it's exactly canon or, you know, whatever you whatever phrase you want to use, standard, or if it's something I made up. Uh, but I am loving this build. Three barracks into an engineering bay. I might have heard it somewhere and, you know, uh, forgive me if I don't credit it to the right person, but I don't remember hearing it. But it works out so well for me um, that I'm sticking with it. Marines, marauders, you know, I should have an pretty much an even number, slightly more marines, because I get to get them out earlier, but yeah, reactor, tech lab, tech lab, I am supply lock, so once again, I send the guys out, that seems to work out the best for me, taking out a random probe, and there's no other way to put it but a random probe, a uh, robotics facility on the way, so he should be getting a colossi later on, here I go, there's the stem, a little late, but I did not expect the army to meet me out on the ramp, and I should be able to clean this up easily. The sentry laying down a force field, kind of out of place. I can easily walk around that, and of course this marauder who never went around it uh, is able to keep firing until it's gone. Uh, but these reinforcements will kill me eventually. Will it be right now? No, this... Oh, but these reinforcements definitely will. And here I start practicing my micro. Here we go. Eh. Eh, come on, kill him. Kill him. Boom. Gone. It was okay. Not the best micro. But it did knock my APM up. Awesome. So I was able to save one Marauder with 49 HP. Still no factory out for me. I did, you know, st lose my macro here as, I, as I'm not getting SUVs, no mules, nothing like that. Uh, hopefully that mule destroying noise reminds me, but it doesn't look like it. Looks like I am going to go for an expansion here. So that is late. <laughs> Let's just face it, that is late. Uh, finally a SUV being trained. There goes the mule. Um, something I do need to work on is micro while macroing, while getting the SCVs, getting the income, getting the production, all that kind of stuff, while keeping track of my army and moving it around. That is something I don't do very well right now. Forge and two gateways along with a pylon. He's got, I mean, he's got a bigger army than I do right now. Yes, he does. Even though I do have quite a large army my, of my own. Uh, but I've spent more on technology, not that much more, only 175 minerals worth. But this should be enough to take it out with Stimpak, I believe. And where is it? Oh, he does a... Sp there it is. Way too late, once again. He does drop down a force field right in the middle, but of course these guys can give these guys sight. Here, a slight change here, not... I mean, just not the most effective use of force fields, uh, but of course it is very hard to use force fields on this map. You do need multiple force fields at the same time. And here I'm just taking pot shots really. I'm not really expecting to take all this stuff down. He is getting a photon can to, to take out um, hopefully something, but look at that. Huge difference in the units lost here. I have been smoking him in the army thanks to those upgrades uh has he does he have any upgrades on these guys no he doesn't dropping another stim i of course sent more reinforcements that's why i was waiting uh and taking pot shots and there goes the forge he will not be able to get any upgrades now going further in marauders of course destroy um the <laughs> photon cannons so he was forced to gg look at that 6,000 units lost as opposed to my less than 2,000s. Uh, so upgrades really paying dividends in the end. Once again, this three racks into an engineering bay is uh, doing wonders for me. Uh, even though the factory was really late, I mean, I could have had tanks out for a while now. Uh, 
but I was sticking with the infantry because it was working so well. These guys should be 1-1. One, one. They are 1-1. One, one. Photon cannon is coming up way too late. Um, these guys would have died soon, and he was forced to leave. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the game. Hope you laugh. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Bye.